Well, a lot of you guys have been asking about our reefing system. So we're gonna take the opportunity of this line squall behind us and walk you through the steps of how we reef and the system that we have set up. Basically, we've got three reefing points. The blue line is reef one, the green line is reef two, the red line is reef three. Uh, they're attached to the boom with a Dyneema loop so that the knot and stuff is up inside of the stack pack so it's not gonna chafe. And then it goes up to the reefing point, back down to some low friction rings on the back of the boom, and then forward through the blocks and to a winch if we need it. But usually when we're reefing, we don't need it. We can just pull it in manually. When we're ready to reef, usually I stay in a cockpit managing the helm and the main sail, while then goes forward onto the mast to reef down the sail. Um, and once he gets up to the mast, the first thing that I do is loosen the main sheet so that uh, the main sail luffs. And it also helps stabilize the boat and reduce a lot of the heel so that he can actually bring the sail down. Step two is reducing tension on the boom vang because when we put this first or second reef in, the boom actually goes up a little bit from where the reefing points are cut into the mainsail. Step three is to lower the main halyard and to hook the first reefing point onto this carabiner that we have and then pull in on the first reef line. Usually I can do that just manually. Sometimes I have to wrap it around this winch and grind it in a little bit. And then the last step is to just grind the main back up and put tension on the halyard. And then I just tighten back up on the boom thing a little bit and then Kegel pulling the main sheet in the cockpit. We also make it a habit to stow our main halyard each and every time in the exact same way so that if we have to put in a second reef, everything's ready in the same way it was for the first reef. So no matter if I'm going forward or if Kika's going forward, we both know what to expect when we get up here. So that is pretty much it. That is all the steps we take to reef our main sail. We also usually roll in a little bit of Jenny just to keep the boat balanced. And depending on how strong the wind picks up, uh, then we figure out whether or not we need to put in the second reef. But if you do have a boat, let us know in the comment below how you reef your sails or if you found this video helpful. And we'll see you guys in our next video. Cheers!